Hello everyone, my name is Dr. Trooper and welcome back to another video. Today I'm showing you guys how to install Improved Pursuit AI into your LSPDFR. First you guys want to do is click the first download link down in the description below. That'll bring you guys right here, straight to the mod, straight to the Improved Pursuit AI version 1 on lcpdfr.com. This mod is made by this guy right here. If you want to show him some love and support for the mod, be sure to leave a review, a comment and check out his other files as well. But to install the mod, the first thing you guys want to do is head down here and click down at this file. And then click here to speed it up a little bit more. And then save. Open the download on up. And then you should be able to see inside of the Improved Pursuit folder, there's going to be default GTA 5 backup. And then that is going to be your standard meta. And then this is going to be your modded meta. So we open up the readme, you guys should be able to see it's a pretty simple install. So install this, what you guys want to do is go to your open IV. Open it on up. Actually, first thing I need to do, you need to always make sure you do this because I just forgot to do it almost, is make sure you use your right copy of GTA 5. This is currently my clean version. As you can see, there's no mods in it. Grab that, clean, and then go into your modded version and make sure you rename that to Grand Theft Auto 5. If you've already done that, then you can just skip this step. But now you can open up your OpenIV, or if you already had it open, then what you guys want to do is go to Windows, let it start on up. And then once it has, for some reason, done this again, this is usually what it does for the first startup, but for some reason it's doing it again. But once it's done this, what you guys are going to want to do is you're going to want to... It's almost done. There we go. Took our time. Uh, what you guys want to do is you're going to want to find your mods folder, go into update, go to update.rpf. Then within here, what you guys want to do is go to common. And then you're going to want to go to data and then go into AI. You'll be able to see here, here is your combat behavior.meta. So if you guys did want to revert, revert, revert back to default, that's a correct word. You can go inside here and just drag and drop this in. But to get your better combat, you can just grab this and drag and drop it in. Make sure you're in edit mode. If you don't have your ASI tools installed like I have for some reason, everything's completely reset. Make sure they're all installed. Grab your combat behavior and simply just drag and drop it in like that. It should be able to see it'll go from compressed encrypted to just compressed and that's how you know it is successfully installed. But just like that, you now have installed your Improved Pursuit AI into your GTA 5. So I hope you guys did find this video useful. If you did, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Leave a comment down below what you guys want to see next, what tutorials or videos, new LSPDFR, Let's Plays, whatever you guys want to call them, just videos in general of me playing the game. We be coming out very, very soon. I just got to get the game finalized and just a couple of bugs sorted out so the videos will run pretty smoothly, hopefully. And make sure you guys subscribe for that and turn the notifications on. Also, check out, check out the channel sponsor down in the description below, Zap Hosting, for all of your server hosting needs. From 5M to Red M, all the way down to Minecraft and DD servers. So be sure to check them out. You can also get virtual private systems, VPSs. So head down in the description below to check them out and use the code Highway Trooper for 20% off all products. But other than that, thank you guys so, so much for watching this video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Cheers and goodbye.